With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hi everyone, let's take a question. So here the question is that a 7.0 molar solution of KOH in the water contains 28% by mass of KOH. So the what is the density of the solution in the gram per milliliter? So if we need to calculate the density of the solution, so it will be the mass of solution that we will take in the grams because here it is in given gram per milliliter. So it will be the volume of the solution and that will be in the milliliters. That will be in the milliliters. Okay. So now here it is given that the 7.0 molar solution. It means that we are given with the molarity that is the 7.0 molars and it is given that it contains the 28% by mass of KOH. If we take the mass of the solution to be the 100 grams, okay, to be 100 grams. So the mass of the solute will be is equal to mass of the solute will be is equal to the 28 grams. It will be is equal to the 28 grams. Okay. So here we have mass of solution 100 grams, mass of solute 28 grams. So now from this part we can calculate the moles because now here we have the mass of solution that is 100, right? That is this one. But we need the volume of the solution. So we know that the molarity is, is equal to the number of moles of solute upon volume of the solution, right? So here now what we will have number of moles first. So the number of moles will be is equal to for the KOH, it will be the 28 upon 56. Okay, 28 is the given weight of the KOH and the 56 is the molecular weight. So from here what we have is the number of moles is equal to 1 by 2. So here we will have that value 1 upon 2 upon V molarity is our 7.0. So from here our volume will be 1 upon 2 right upon 7 upon 7. So it will be 0 0.5 upon 7 that is 0 0.07. Okay, so here our volume is, is equal to 0 0.07 liters. Okay, it is our liters. But we need the volume in the milliliters. We need the volume in the milliliters. So here it will be the 0 0.07 into 10 raised to power 3 milliliters. It will be 0 0.07 into 10 raised to power 3 milliliters. Okay, so here our density will be equal to the mass upon volume. Mass is our 100 upon 0 0.07 into 10 raised to power 3. So here our density comes out to be the 1.4 grams per milliliters. Okay, it means that here our answer is 1.4 grams per milliliters. So that is our answer. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.